simulations gain more and more significance and, at the same time, more and more data becomes available. The Cluster of Excellence Data Integrated Simulation Science at the University Stuttgart combines both of these areas and has defined three visions. Engineered Geosystems, Next Generation Virtual Materials Design and the Digital Human Model. During everyday interactions, we humans are highly adept at reading and also interpreting behaviors of others and in adapting our own behavior to them on the fly, despite the fact that this can be quite tricky at times. The long-term vision of our research is to equip computers with the same abilities, whether user interfaces used today already or future virtual agents and also robots. To realize this vision, we have to address three core research challenges. The first one is that we need to develop computational methods and systems to sense everyday social and interactive human behavior, such as gaze and body language. Second, we have to develop methods that allow us to model human behavior and cognition in a computational way. And third, we have to develop methods that allow computers to synthesize behavior that is appropriate to the current situation, but also perceived as natural by a human. Sensing behavior accurately and robustly is challenging because of the large variability of human behavior in daily life settings. We tackle this problem using a combination of real-world data and new methods from machine learning. For example, we've developed a new method for estimating gaze direction of multiple people interacting with each other. Gaze estimation is the basis for other tasks such as eye contact detection. Automatic eye contact detection in the future could help, for example, people with autism spectrum disorders. These people struggle to engage and disengage eye contact in social encounters. A second key research challenge is computational modeling of human cognitive systems, where we develop methods to teach machines to learn and understand like humans from multimodal sensory input. One example is gaze behavior modeling, which is the task of predicting where gaze falls in an image, natural scene, or text, without the use of any eye tracker. For this, a cognitive model of gaze is required. Computational modeling has many practical applications, such as assistive technology for e-learning. Once we've modeled human behavior, we're able to synthesize it in a way that humans find both natural and appropriate. For example, if we've modeled attention through eye gaze, we can render it in a 3D model of an avatar or even a humanoid robot. Of course, social interaction is not limited to gaze, so we're also interested in synthesizing other multiple modalities, such as speech and body language. Once we have a simulated human, we can study for the first time the whole dynamic loop of interactive behavior between humans and machines. Taken together, our interdisciplinary research on sensing, modeling, and also synthesizing human behavior and cognition contribute directly to the central SimTech vision of a digital human model and also has the potential to fundamentally change the way we interact with machines and the way machines interact with us.